In this week's edition of the Business Review, a new ice cream company on the market with a twist, offering all our favorite Jamaican flavors in the one dessert, Cody and Barrett reports. New Palette Awakening, another addition to the ice cream industry, but this time all natural based Jamaican flavors and sweet treats that captures the boldness of our culture. It began when a friend gifted managing co-director of That's Cold Ice Creamery, Shanique Bethune, an ice cream maker. With her background in food and nutrition, she began experimenting. At first, she was just making ice cream for the family. Not long after, she started getting requests from friends and the extended family. When the pandemic came, she got motivated to turn her hobby into a business. I remember I was sitting in my TV room and just saying, you know, in this time, why not fulfill something that I want to fulfill? Something that, you know, my children can inherit further down in life and just something for me that I can call my own. And in saying that to myself, you know, the Lord just confirmed and said, just go, just, just do it. With help from her family, the company launched mid-2020, but she wasn't prepared for the limitations the COVID-19 restrictions would pose on her ability to secure locations for tastings. So because of COVID, you know, there are a lot of restrictions with persons being so close to each other, doing tastings of, of, of such nature. So because you are new to the market, persons not just going to buy a product like that, they want to know what they're tasting, they want to know what they're buying. And so that was one of our biggest challenges that we had. Eventually, she secured a location which exposed people to the brand. The next step was partnering with another authentic Jamaican restaurant, Glorious Seafood, where the product was sold. I was actually astonished by the amount of persons that came out to support. It was, it was crazy. And I'm like, wow, I can do this. And, and persons were like, yeah, this is really good. Like, tell me, what are you putting in your ice cream? And I'm like, I can't, if I tell you, I kind of have to hire you. <laughs> because, you know, it's something that is within the family. But persons were like, one of the things that kept coming was we can taste the fruits, we can, we can identify the different flavors. With a new flavor on Special Weekly, she even got calls for deliveries. Customers also submit special requests for ice cream flavors, but there are also favorites. The jackfruit and the coconut drops, point blank. So the jackfruit and the coconut drops are our non-dairy flavors. And we find that a lot of persons in Jamaica or just worldwide are trying to be healthy. And in being healthy, you want a healthier option. Um, in the hotel, you find that the Black Forest cake ice cream is the number one seller. Now, the brand can be found in several supermarkets and hotels across the island. Between September and December, I would say that there was, a, let's say, about a 40, 50 percent growth. But between J January and now July, you're seeing where it's more of a 60, 65 percent growth. As for input cost, Ms. Bethune plants some of her fruits and other ingredients, resulting in a further 20% profit. And although exporting is on the agenda, the company aims to saturate the island first. Once we become a household name that persons on the outside, regionally, throughout the Caribbean, will want to know what this is, will be, have interest in wanting this product, so that we can now export within the Caribbean and then throughout the world. Korean Barrett, TVJ News.